Yo, what is up everybody? We are back for episode eight of Beef and everything is in shambles. Amy's in shambles, Danny's in shambles. Uh, Amy just lost her whole family and uh, Danny just lost his parents' house. Somebody set it on fire. Uh, we kind of think that it's Edwin because he had brought it up earlier in conversation and Amy doesn't know where his parents' house mm -hmm. is. So um, yeah. It's gonna be interesting to see how this plays out. So we're gonna jump into episode eight here, the drama of original choice. Two thousand eight. Yeah, flashback. Come closer. That's when we graduated That's high Amy school. Are you serious about the blanket? What the yeah, hell? I played a lot of games, so tell me your name at least. Did she just meet you up and smash this guy? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. Make sure to spit on it first, okay? Yeah. Oh, that was like her thing, like too when she's. <laughs> oh, yeah, with Paul. <sighs> Obama. Man, they're making this shit seem like it's an eternity ago. I feel so old. Yeah. The F? What the fuck? Oh, what, what that, that was weird. That's scary as hell. Yeah. Oh, that's how she sees herself. I see. I can bring him around. So, Paul showed him the text. For me, why are you helping me? I'm a helpful person. But without you, he'd be... Oh, he thinks she would drown. Ocean, he would drown without her. Gray. So he'd get half, but eventually, like, it would just all be nothing, and then, then she would end up no right back where she that was. Damn, and she just said he's no artist. Mr. Mackey, boy, she stole gotta it. get as far away from here as I can. Mm. She's supposed to be at school. The that fuck, that's so creepy. Oh my god, this <laughs> oh, that that like is so creepy to me. Yeah, oh. it is. Amy. Hi mom. Oh my gosh. You draw so far. Yeah. Are you guys making out in front of the Louvre? Oh. <laughs> it's been a fun couple of years. Come, let's eat Amy. That's yeah. so like they haven't heard from her in two years and they're yeah. actually chill about it. You act like we're so evil. What do we ever do, huh? We provide it. We sacrifice. We moved here just for you. What do we get in return? And that's crazy, Kisha. When she was talking to her therapist, she said, I know my parents love me. Do, do you want more proof? I should go to bed. I think that's actually what was the catalyst for her going to see them because mm -hmm. her therapist started to like dig deeper and she, she didn't has more trauma related and she her. didn't want to talk about it. She was like, well, I'm actually talking about myself. Your father, he's a good man. Wait, what do you mean? You and dad already talked about it? No, we don't have to. And you and I don't have to either. Okay, see now this is the problem with our family. We never talked about anything openly. Maybe. Like, and now that's enough. Just stop. Okay, yep. okay. She gets I just wish you talked to me growing up. Why are you bringing this up now? Huh? Are you in George? Have we brought it? Mm. This is about you and dad. More and more when I look in the mirror, I see you and dad. And I hate it. I know that sounds ungrateful. Okay, I, I don't know, maybe you felt the same way about your parents too at some point. You know, just generations of bad decisions sitting inside you. Whatever is going on, put it behind you. Josh is good for you, for June too. Hmm? Not the point, but okay. So she heard them arguing. You want those come from? They're from me making money. Having a child is expensive. What are you talking about? We didn't have a choice. Mmm, so, mmm. So that's why, oh wow. And then there goes the image yeah. that she's seeing. And Don't misbehave, I'm always watching. That's terrifying. What the F? I would never buy my kid a book like that. <laughs> but it was, a, listen, in the 90s, there was some I shit. I understand. I meant now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Shh. 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 Shh.
can't tell anyone your secrets. How come? Because no one would love you. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it's making me want to watch a horror movie. I'm not even gonna lie. <laughs> but this is a horror movie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wa watching two people crash out. Take your time. I I I I don't know. His mom's dynamic seems like it's changed a little bit. Like I don't know. How to explain it. Because of how she heard her talk about George, yeah. so she's like, you know, she really cared for my like son, you. and he'd be lost without her. He, they really care about each other, so like, let me help them fix it. Mm -hmm. She said that you were just messing with that kid online. I want to clear the air and put this all behind us. So you think she's gonna lie? Don't lie. I slept with him. Okay, thank you for not lying. I don't want to hide things anymore. I was mad, but I thought we could talk it out. Is she gonna tell him about Zane? You let me be friends with him. Oh, uh, yep. You let me invite him to our home. This deranged Korean. But she didn't man. know he was Zane. Seen that dangerous at the time. I don't know how to explain it. My mom was hospitalized, Amy, and you still doubled down. You yeah. put June in danger. I don't understand. How you can hate this guy so much? Are you obsessed with him? I don't know. I want to blame my parents, but um, I think it's just me. I feel like I married a stranger. George, I'm a bad person. I want a divorce. No. You can have the house. You can have everything. Please don't take Judy away from me. The lawyers will figure it out. Damn, she just really fell to pieces. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Damn, wait, how old is she? she all them teeth? At least one, or <laughs> close to one. <laughs> is that Danny? Yeah. Sing <sighs> song. Sung Hyun is his real name. Mm -hmm. Again, don't hesitate to ask your insurance provider. Okay. Oh, what? And now Paul feels see arson. like. And I'm just citing that as an example. If somebody Paul burns down your house, you, that's not covered? I, 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 Whoa. I, that probably depends on your insurance provider. How does she know about this house? Yeah. I told her about it before we broke up. Oh, mm. okay. Dude, what the but I still don't think I'm it was sorry. her. God, we're so sorry. close. Because she. Historically, kind of let stuff go. She wouldn't take it that far. But he needs to find out if she actually yeah. did it first before just retaliating. But she would never admit to, yeah, I burned down your house. But technically, he didn't cause her to lose her husband. She could have lied and said, oh, no, it was just an online thing, and he would have forgiven her. But... You know, she told him. But the confession happened. The confession is oh, after this day. Okay. I think it was Edwin's bitch ass. Yeah. Yeah. Oh wow. Yeah. But why would you do that? And then why would you show up, bro? Yeah, he's doing something. Is he some like conspiring recon. with his cousin, trying to like make some money? Or Isaac something? is out of the picture. You gotta divorce her, right? Take her for all she's worth? Terrible I, advice. That didn't even cross my mind. I can't imagine my life without her. Did he, did he really take his advice? Uh, what just happened? He Don't go me. Monica? You about to be in there like Batman. Fuck! <laughs> you burned down my house! Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about! What the fuck? I saw you! I was just burned down my house! I was just messing through! Relax! Why were you there? Why Magazine subscriptions. Oh, that was you. Just messing around. That's just fucking lying to me, dude. All right, all right, all right. right. She's right. jealous. Jealous? Now we're going to get fucking mine. Veronica always speaks so highly of you. She's never gotten over you. Well, that was obvious. You're the best she's ever had. So. Mm. But well, that's an excuse for jealous. you to come I F with me? Like, that's. Burn down your house. Jealous. Okay, so it wasn't I, him. I, I swear. That, what you did was not nice! <laughs> it's not nice to do that! 
because he didn't really do anything. Like, he's mad at his wife, so you're taking it on, on the guy, like, that she was with forever ago. Oh, damn. She's charging magazine subscription. That's annoying. <laughs> okay. I still don't feel like it's Amy. Yeah. Grades, then we could go to school at the same time. Aww. <laughs> That's the plan. I think it's a that good kid plan. really looks like Paul. Wow. Yeah, he does. Mm, and he did, he did the, the wiring. He did the wiring. All over. Absolute moron installed. <laughs> oh my God. Maybe we should keep investigating because, like, that's. That was really he he wants it to be Amy. He wanted to, to blame it on somebody else other than himself being his own downfall. But now the construction now, company, the construction the company has to pay for that. There's a USB on this outlet. I yep, 14 gauge. I did I, I did all the wiring myself. Why would you not hire somebody to? Because he thought that he was that he thought he was that guy. He thought he was him. So he's the one that burnt You're, down. He's the lucky house. his parents wasn't in the house when. It was me. Sorry, man. It's oh wow, he lied. Gasoline canister. In a this guy is the house. worst. I'm sorry, but I I'm trying to like really you like know what you're, care for this man. It was a woman's glove. Amy. Dude, what? No, no, we're not and he here. knows we're his gonna brother's not gonna listen thing, to him. He's Yo, still gonna go and want to do yeah, what he want to do anyway. And now his brother's right. gonna blame himself great. for that every single day. But not only that, this is gonna end really yeah, bad. Up. Come here, yo. Hey. You're the worst. I'm sorry, but I, I highly, yeah, I can't rock highly with him. Highly dislike you right now. I bro. can't rock with him after that, especially since after what just happened, how he went and went to George and. Okay. She's literally minding her business at this point, bro. Like you're just making booze behind her back. I'm doing my own thing. Like, he uses his brother as like, like a, I don't know how to explain it. Hey, can you give me it. some light balls from downstairs? Like I don't want to see, I, it's like a crutch is not the word that I want to like use, but it's just like, um, I don't know how to explain it, but crutch is not, like not the term I'm thinking of. It's almost like his brother's his anchor. Really, dude? Really? Mm -hmm. Throwing away the college acceptance letters? Wow, you suck. He's the literal worst. As I said, his brother's like his anchor. It's like he can't do nothing without his brother. I guess that you could call that a crutch, but it's just like his brother's not really helping him. Wait, though. what does he do? Mm -hmm. I hate you. You deserve that. Sure. For lying. <laughs> right here, oh, man. Oh. Hey. I can see you. Zane. <laughs> All right, Does you look he really creepy. He, he doesn't know. I brought you a Koya house plant. He's. I need to figure out what Danny's doing because he brought a. He bought gloves. He bought a gasoline can. Um, He's trying canister. to plant it. Oh, yeah. Hey, do you mind? If, do you mind if I uh, use your bathroom real quick? Yes, I mind. I, I drank too much Gatorade. That purple one's so good. He'll go outside. I, I'll be real quick and I'm gone. Of course. Yeah. Oh no. Thanks, man. Or right, he's gonna remember the leak. And that he, he was the, the one that did there. the. Oh, this toilet's crazy, man. It's opening his mouth and shit. Oh. You're under arrest. What? Sure, man. what? Citizen's arrest? What's going on? I know everything. Danny. Yeah. The police are on their way. So just put your hands above your head and stay put. Oh, this is getting crazy. Oh my God. Where's Junie? She better stay in the car. Oh my God. He's about to get. Oh, assault. <gasps> Why don't you leave George. these people alone? You are the worst. He George. is the literal worst. <laughs> oh my God. This is why things keep getting so much worse for him. I hope he's just knocked out. I hope it's another fake out. Yeah, he's probably knocked out, but like, and now the gun's just on the floor. And his daughter's just in the car. Well, now they're gonna be looking for you. Cause he's gonna be assaulted on, on. and on the floor. <gasps> what? Hey, oh my! God. What is she doing in your car? What is she getting the wrong car on accident? Get hit with kidnapping, bro. Didn't he's 
He said you can always ask me for a certain candy. Hang on. In this, my car. This, uh, but like. He said I always have some in my car. So do you think that, but that was when he was driving a different truck. Yeah, I, I don't know. Hang on. Did the dad um, not say, I'm gonna go put you in the car? Hang on, I, I just need to make, be sure. The verbiage? Of the verbiage. Hang on, and he said. Okay. just stay in there, don't come back. It's uh, before that, like, yeah. a little bit before. <clears throat> So he put her in their car and then she got out of their car and hopped in his truck for some strange reason with the dog. Or did he put her in the wrong car? That, why would he do that? I don't know. Because just in case their he car, tried to run off? Their car is in their... I, I, so just in case he... just in That's case. stupid. How would he even... I, I, I don't know. That doesn't make any sense to me. I think that the little girl hopped out of the car but why would she do that because the skittles i think she saw the skittles in his car and just assumed that hey it's a pickup truck he it's probably the same guy and he probably has skittles well, she knows it's or, the same guy. oh she knows that it was she zane so she, yes yes she knows him so it's literally because of the skittles thing so he set himself up for that he's like oh yeah i always had that candy in my car because she had the pack of skittles in the back oh i'm just hey I literally don't care if he gets arrested. Literally He's, doesn't care if he goes to prison. Listen, <laughs> He's the I worst. defended him a couple episodes, but th at this point, I literally can't. Like, like you. I messed don't think up. you're meant to like him. Like, I don't think you're meant as a viewer. But it's weird to because like this person. you can feel bad for like certain situations that have happened to him in his life. But like taking his brother's college letters and throwing them in, them in the trash and then like doing all that extra other stuff he was doing, like to keep his brother with him, like because of his whatever trauma he had as a child. <clears throat> I, I don't know. Like at this point, I can see like growth in Amy, but it's like he's going backwards. Like Amy is like improving, actually. She hasn't really like retaliated or anything to any of the stuff that he's actually done like but he just keeps like he's still like addicted to their beef she's trying to move on from it because the guy was like what are you like obsessed with him or something she's like i don't know like now she's actually trying to figure out like what is wrong with me and but why am i so obsessed with i wouldn't that? say that he's obsessed with the beef but now he's seeing he it. is but though. no but now i think he's using it as a way to like solve his problem or use her as like a scapegoat because he thought it was Amy and then saw Edwin so then he was like nah it was Edwin because he wasn't addicted to the beef because he was like why would Amy do this he's like I didn't like antagonize her like and then Paul told him what happened and then he got upset with Paul like why would you do this and then he saw Edwin then he went after Edwin so it's not like like he was just like and then he was wrong all about, about Edwin and then it ended beef. up being himself Yes, but and this, then now, but this solves his problem. But how? Because it would make Amy responsible to pay for the police if they find out it's her. But she would literally go to jail. Yeah, yeah. Listen, I. <laughs> that's crazy. My man literally went in there and planted evidence in her bathroom, like, and then possibly killed George, or almost killed George. Yeah. But my thing is, but this is why I'm so upset about that part particular situation, right? Because George literally just went off on Amy. This is why his mother was talking about him drowning, right? Because he literally just went off on Amy for not telling him who he really was because he was putting him and his and her, her daughter's life at risk and that she wasn't doing a good job in protecting the two of them by not letting them know that information. But you let him in the house. I got a rebuttal. And I you what, let him go nope, in the bathroom. I, I know where you're you going with this, and I already have a rebuttal. He needs to feel like he's the hero, like he saved the day. Yes, already, but now look what you did. Now you literally put yourself in a situation to get your head knocked against the concrete wall, and your daughter is now yeah, in the back of his but car. But that, that, that's fine, though. Like, yeah, we understand that, but that falls in line with his character. That makes complete sense why he did that, because... He needs to feel like he's a man and he's protecting his family. So that's why he was like, I'm gonna take matters into my own hands. Um, yeah, and, and failed. Stop this. Yeah, he failed, but he tried, right? 
hey, but. And he keeps learning over and over and over again that he's a failure. You know what? Like a big part of me feels like he was like, I want the divorce because he knows that it was truly not him who was the hero in the whole chair situation. He can blame it on whatever he wants to blame it on. Mm. But this little situation shows wow. like him being so useless, like in everything. Even the daughter's like, I don't like you, bro. I'm not trying to go with you. <laughs> like, it's just like. <laughs> Full circle that he's just I didn't like, think about that. I, I'm trying to run things now. And she's like, nah, yeah. I don't want to be with you. I want to be with mom. Mom is like the real one getting stuff done. I know you're the one watching me, but that's all you do. Yeah, that's actually, that actually makes a lot of sense. Okay. <sighs> we got two episodes left. And it's crazy because this show just went from like dark comedy to just straight up drama and just sadness and depression. So, yeah. All okay. right, let's see how this wraps up. That's going to be it for episode eight, guys. And on to the next. As always, like, subscribe. Follow on all socials. Everybody, Roshi, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. Subscribe and share. Link down below. Check out the merch link today. It's also down below. But that's all we got for you guys today. Hope you have a great day, and we'll catch you guys next time. Peace.